Hello guys, this is Jack from Fox Tech, and I hope you like those foam planes. Of course, the foam planes or drones has a great shape, great aerodynamic and light, and sometimes not so durable. So that's why we are going to offer you a solution. That the solution is called the foam armor. The foam armor is kind of a special painting we apply to the foam planes, just the original foam planes, and to increase the surface hardness and the total strength a lot, a lot. So let me show you some example. Well, just uh, on the left and on the right, you can see two Nimbus Vitals with the painting. Great color, great color. I like gray. What do you think? And also here is an example of the original foam tail soft and easy to get scratched. And here is an example. Well, this is an example we fly for over uh, eight months already from this April. And this is the painted version. And a, we flew it at least 100 times or even more than that. So as you can see, the detail of the surface uh, barely see any scratch or any mark on it. Uh, this one is uh, pretty new, actually, it's pretty new. Well, let's uh, do just a strings or strings uh, comparison. Well, the problem of the original foam tail is actually we have the carbon fiber tube extended right here, and for this part, no, there's no bone inside, so maybe like this. Yeah, I didn't add any carbon fiber tubes or any uh, structure inside, just a simple painting solve all the problem. You can see it's a pretty hard. This one is a pretty hard. Okay, so talking about the surface hardness, let's do an example like this. Well, this is a pretty sharp thing. Well, I can do this. I can try to leave a mark, leave a scratch on it, but it doesn't work. So surface hardness very, very high. Also, the material is light and it does increase some weight on the tail, but just one or say five grams or six grams on the tail and the total for the whole drone is uh, 300 grams increased. But, well, let's say you have the increased hardness, increased uh, better looking and everything and the, the lifetime of your drone can be greatly, greatly enhanced. Well, I'm going to show you another example. Well, okay, uh, 30, uh, a lot of marks on it. But this wing, to be frankly, we only flew 10 times, 20 times. So we put it away and uh, somebody put a lot of things, so maybe uh, the plane body on it. So a lot of, a lot of scratch. And this, and this one is also made in April until now it's like eight months. So we flew around 100 or 200 times because we test our planes every day. And you see, it's just a pretty new. You barely see any mark on it. And uh, you may see, uh, yeah, this is still very, very new. So actually, we like foam plane because it's light and uh, it's easy to make uh, because making a foam plane uh, takes maybe just the one tenth time of making a composite material plane. So the foam planes are cheap and it can be mass produced. And but the first surface, the strings, the hardness are not so comfortable for us, for the professional drone players. So this uh, foam armor offer you a solution. And we are going to offer the Nimbus VTOL with the foam armor painted uh, for a small amount, because uh, we are still under development of uh, trying to uh, get a better looking uh, with the total spray, total coating. Well, but actually, even that, our Total strength, smoothness, hardness of the drone is already greatly increased. So, um, well, talking about uh, the drones, and uh, many people buy the drones to apply for a contract, try to win the contract, but if you buy a foam plane, it doesn't work. But uh, the government or the military people may want a very long lifetime, and uh, they just want to put it away and throw it away and never care about it. But the, the foam plane cannot do this work. 
and that's they don't care. But some people or most people care about uh, the better looking and the great looking of their drones and looks professional. So we take this, this is a steel foam inside by adding a special foam armor. Just feel it. It's very, very hard. Okay. Well, although the foam painting is good, and, uh, but we still limited by some uh, difficulties uh, to treat the surface. So you may see a mark or a small bubble somewhere, but it doesn't affect the total looking. So we are offering some small amount of the Nimbus Vito with painting, which can fly over 19 minutes in the air, and it now can hover in the air for over 27 minutes. This is a great plane, and uh, if you are interested in this, you can buy it and try, but we only offer a small amount, less than five in a, in a week. So now we are going to offer a small amount of a Nimbus Vito, just a small amount, maybe five pieces in a week, because we are still trying to mass product it and trying to make everything perfect. But if you don't care about maybe a small bubble or a some uh, small mark somewhere. and uh, But the total looking is just like this. It's totally very beautiful, very durable. And if you don't care about it, you can start to order. So we don't charge much for the coating because uh, it really requires a lot of experience, time to do it. But uh, yeah, it's something new. I, I like new things. I hope you also like new things. We always, always try to get some new things and uh, make your friend surprised. OK, so, uh, but the good news is we are going to offer the Nimbus of Vito with the painted tail start from now. So even you don't buy the totally painted Nimbus, you can also get a free pair of a painted tail on your drone. It's uh, so hard and just, just feel it and uh, hope you can order the Nimbus with uh, fully covered painted in the future. Okay, well, let's try this. Super hard. Uh, maybe try it on table. And I hope you get impressed by this test. Okay, I was always impressed by the good performance of the foam painting. Okay, so simple video about the foam painting and the C on the left and the right. There are Nimbus Vito with painted a good color and also very smooth surface, very good hardness, very long flight time and also very long lifetime. This is the most important thing. Okay, hope you like this and uh, if you are interested in, in this Nimbus, Vito, and also the coated version, you can go to our website, which is the foxtechip.com. And to start from now, the foxtech.com is also in our hand. You can also visit it. And also we have the YouTube, we have the uh, Facebook, Twitter, and they are all quite interesting. Just a try. Do not forget to subscribe to us. Okay, this is Jack from Foxtech. Hope you like the foam armor. Remember, this is only from Foxtech. Thanks for watching.